what's going on guys welcome back to the channel so today i'll be taking a look at the top 10 most anticipated anime of 2022 for me as someone who just started watching anime i'm loving it it's been amazing until now so uh yeah we're gonna see what other animes i can look forward to this year and i hope that i can watch some of these animes with you guys so yeah if you guys are new to the channel please hit the like and subscribe button let me know what other features as a check out and let's hop onto this video Twenty twenty one has been a stellar year for anime fans. Huge hits like JoJo's Bizarre Adventure continue to delight, and the new favorites like Ranking of Kings have emerged triumphant. Now, while we could be sad that it's all coming to an end, there's no reason to mourn as we can look forward to even more amazing anime in twenty twenty two. Now, whether you're eagerly awaiting the sophomore series of a show you already love or looking for something entirely new, Ooh. next year is stacked with releases that I have you eagerly counting down the days until next year. Based on the manga by the same name, this action adventure series became a cult favorite among anime lovers when it was released in 2017. Now since then, fans have gotten a feature length movie continuing the story, but have been waiting patiently for the second oh, this season. Looks so now cool. this immersive fantasy is set in a world where a strange series of deep pits and tunnels run under the surface of the land. Known as the Abyss, they're relatively undiscovered, but brave explorers known as cave raiders explore them in the hopes of finding strange artifacts. Now, though we don't know when exactly to expect this next year, we do know season two will be hitting sometime in 2022. This looks pretty cool. Now, if you can believe it, it'll be 11 whole years since season one of Tiger and Bunny debuted by the time we receive years? the second Whoa. season next year. Now, while it might seem like a long time to wait, it's actually fitting as this series was well ahead of its time. Now, in the world of Tiger and Bunny, the superheroes are the ultimate celebrities, including the titular heroes. Now, with the amount of superhero movies and shows we've received since Tiger and Bunny's first season, the question is, how will the anime have changed to reflect our even more superhero-saturated times? But we'll have to wait and see. That's cool. Produced by Studio Trigger, this spin-off of the controversial Cyberpunk 2077 is one of the biggest anime releases of 2022. Now, while this series will take place in Night City, it's an entirely separate story from the game. And with the director of Promare and Kill la Kill attached to helm the project, anime fans are in for a visual and narrative treat with this unique take on Night City in Cyberpunk Edge Runners. <laughs> I haven't played a game yet, but a friend of mine has been playing it and he loves it. So I'm look this this looks pretty interesting because the, the drawing already looks pretty cool. But also uh the I, I saw I saw him play the game and the game also looked pretty cool. So this looks like you know what I'm just gonna wait and see when they release our official trailer. So this looks cool. Also it's on Netflix, so should be cool. After the unbelievable heel turn in the first half of season four, viewers are chomping at the bit to find out what's Still going to, to happen watch with this anime. Yeager and company in the final episodes of Attack on Titan. Now, it's hard to talk too much about what we want here without, you know, massive spoilers, but a redemption arc would be welcomed alongside that classic Attack on Titan giant monster action. I still don't know anything about this anime. <laughs> After the record-breaking uh, success really of one. Dragon Ball Super Broly, arguably the most famous anime franchise on Earth is heading back to the big screen with a brand new movie. Original creator Akira Toriyama returns once again to pen a new story and challenge for our Z Warriors. From what we've seen so far, it looks like another action-packed entry Damn. into the sprawling anime series with a refreshingly unique take regarding the uses of CG animation. Nice. Uzumaki looks like it might just be able to capture the quiet and existential horror that has made creator Junji Ito such an icon within the space. Now, sticking far closer to Ito's instantly recognizable style than previous adaptations, Whoa. Uzumaki collects a haunting set of stories that paint a picture of a small town driven mad by an obsession with spirals. Now, while it may not sound that terrifying on the surface, it's the sort of creepy psychological tale that gets under your skin and oh. haunts you in nightmares.
you best believe I'm gonna watch this when it comes out. This massively popular manga series launched in 2019 and gained a huge following and it's easy to see why. Spy Family has massive Batman family energy as the titular spy has to create the perfect family as a front. Now that would be, you know, funny enough sentiment, but little does he know that his new wife and daughter have secret lives of their own. His faux life hey. partner is actually an assassin and his recently adopted child is a powerful mind reader. With Wit Studio and Cloverworks <laughs> handling the animation, fans are in for a truly humorous and heartwarming ride. I think I'm definitely going to watch that one as well because I love documentaries and I love uh, detective stuff. So yeah, that one's definitely gonna, uh, getting on my list. Netflix is taking on the daunting legacy of a new original anime based on the acclaimed Spriggan manga. Now, Spriggan is a Cold War set action story that reimagines the historical era when strange out of place artifacts begin showing up around the world. Now, political superpowers begin trying to use them for their own gain, Ooh. leading to the creation of a private army. This looks kind of dope. Operatives are known as Spriggans. Sorry. Spinning off from the immensely popular Kakeguri, this prequel centers on Mary, one of the antagonists of the original at the elite and gambling obsessed private academy a year before the mainline story. Now this prequel is an exciting chance to get to know Mary better as well as a way to add depth, context, and history to the already beloved series. Now, the sports story subgenre has long since been one of the biggest strengths of the mediums, and in 2018, Blue Lock came along to add a vibrant and engaging new story to the canon. Now, the story follows a young amateur soccer player who joins the elite institute known as Blue Lock. In a search for a so-called ace striker, the Japanese football union has gathered hundreds of the best and brightest to make their next team unbeatable. Blue Lock is definitely worth placing on your list, especially if you're a sports enthusiast that geeks out on anime. Okay, should check it out. I love football, so well, we call it football, so <laughs> looks cool. And there you have it. Those are our top 10 anticipated anime of 2022. Now, there nice. are still a lot of anime without release date confirmations, but we're hoping to see Chainsaw Man, Jujutsu Kaisen Ooh. Zero, the movie, and the Bleach's Thousand Year Blood War arc in 2022. Now, what are you looking forward to in 2022? Let us know in the comment section down below. And for more anime, check out the latest fall anime releases in case you missed them and our list of the best anime on Netflix right now. And for everything else, stick with IGN. There you have it, guys. I'm not gonna lie. There are some really cool animes in between, especially the cyberpunk one. The way it was drawn was really cool. And also the one with the spiral, I think it was called Uz Uz Uzumaki or some something like that. But uh, forgive me if I pronounce it wrong, but that looks super cool with the spiral. It looked really creepy as well, just as the guy was saying. But yeah, there are a couple of animes that I'm going to check out. So if you guys have any other ideas and any other animes you guys think I should check out, let me know down in the comment section. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. And let me know what other videos I should check out. If you guys have any videos, leave the link down in the comment section and I'll make sure to, to check it out. Thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, take care of yourself and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.